Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Fling and Fall 1 and 2 by Catstring slash Blockhamster34. Fling your way to victory in this relatively simple puzzle. Built in approximately 45 minutes using about 10 elements. Alright, let's check it out. Interesting. What do you have up here? It gets this a cube that immediately fizzles itself. Hmm. Dot. Well, this is a dot. That looks like dot up there. Hmm. Well, we need a cube to get up there, don't we? Oh, wait, that- what? That turns off the fizzler? Why, though? What does the dot go to, then? I'm not entirely sure, but okay. If you say so. So we have the cube now. Now what? Guess we wanna fling up top right? Yeah, so we can do that. So now we're up here. I guess we just want the cube up here, right? Oh, that is not what I thought that was gonna do. Okay, then. What in the world? Okay, I'm so confused right now. Why couldn't this just be stairs? <laughs> or like a faceplate or something. Oh well. Anyway, what does all this stuff do? That was it? What was... What was that area for? I didn't even need to use that area down there. Huh. I think I may have broken this, or something, because, uh... I'm not sure what that's for, to be honest. But anyway, let's just get out of here and go on to the next one. Alright, Fling and Fall 2, which we will read the description of once the map loads. Let's see here. Fling your way to victory again in this also relatively simple puzzle, built in approximately 45 minutes. Alright. Well, this one's taller. We have this again, but I don't know what it's for. Hmm. Well, I guess we can actually use it this time, right? So we're up here now. What does this do? Why, though? Here we go. Okay. Do this, and this. So now we're up here. Let me guess. Something like that. And this? Yeah, why though? What? Hmm... So maybe I need to go up there first? So I'm up here now. What was that for though? Hmm. Let's- let's head back down there again for a moment. If I can. Yeah, I can get back down here. Alright. Get the cube back up here or not. There we go. So if I just put this here, that simplifies things, right? Yeah, so now I'm up here. Ah, oh, and I can put a portal there. But I'm still confused about what the rest of everything's for. Let me guess this turns off these sizzlers? Indeed it does. So now I can put the other portal here, right? Yeah, not much of a puzzle, just basically... ...bringing the cube with you at every step of the way. Yeah. Not much to these, unfortunately. 
I would definitely recommend watching Demon Arisen's How to Make Great Test Chamber series on YouTube, and also Rector Rox's guide on the Steam Workshop. Anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!